Hey there everyone and welcome back to Google Guru. Today I wanted to touch on an issue that a lot of Google Apps administrators have and that's controlling your users access to third-party applications. Especially with Google Apps there's plenty of opportunities for users to install applications from a number of different sources. So they can install from the Chrome Web Store, from the add-on section in Docs and Sheets. There's just tons of opportunities for users to install applications and as an administrator you really need to be able to have visibility into what people are installing and prevent them from installing something that may have some risk to your domain. One of the best ways to combat this issue and get more visibility into your users activity is through the Apps Explorer tool from Flash Panel. So Apps Explorer gives a administrator visibility into what third-party applications have access to your Google Apps domain. So for example, inside a flash panel here, you can see that I have all of these applications that are accessing my domain. And as I go through here, I can see what kind of permissions they're accessing. So they're accessing Google Drive or Google Plus. And I can see where they have access to. Is it to my entire domain? Is it limited to a specific uh, organization? And how many users have installed it? So as I go through here, I can see uh, what the applications are, and I can say, okay, Camtasia, this is a fine application. I use this for recording videos, so I'm going to go ahead and whitelist this application. So this obviously means my users will continue to be able to use this application, but if I see that there's a tool that I don't want them accessing, I can click on the X and blacklist it or blacklist and notify users. So this is great for something that may be accessing too many permissions for your domain or if you think it may be some sort of malicious application. The feature that just recently came out for Apps Explorer is the ability to create policies. So a third-party apps policy will allow you to specify which apps have access to your domain and apply that on a recurring basis. So I can go in here and create my first policy and you can specify what level you want this policy to apply to. So you can say entire domain, org unit, or by a specific user. So I'm going to say for now org unit. And let's see if I can find my interns org unit. So this is a, you know, a great example that you may not want interns having access to some sort of application with a lot of access. So I'll continue. And then I'll say what kind of conditions do I want to limit applications to? So just for an example here, I'm going to say if an application has read and write access to Gmail and if the permission score is less than or equal to 5, then I will want to go ahead and blacklist the application. So when I'm done, I can go ahead and save and run this policy and have it applied to my intern org unit on a recurring basis. So this is a quick intro to the Apps Explorer tool inside a flash panel. If you have any questions about Apps Explorer, feel free to leave us a comment in the section below the video. Thanks.